You're watching Tampa Bay CW44 News at 10. A 115-year-old Tampa staple reopens today in Ybor City. The original Columbia restaurant welcomed back customers for the first time since COVID-19 shut its doors back in March. CW44's Price McKeon caught up with the fourth generation owner. I needed this today. My dad, that Leroy Neiman did that sketch, he's over my heart. Oh, Lord, he's protecting me, and he's uh, giving me the guidance and confidence to do what I'm doing. Holding a mask and reflecting on the past, Richard Gonsmart stands in front of his family's restaurant, a Tampa staple that sits in the heart of Ybor City on 7th Avenue, the Columbia Restaurant. There's a great sense of emotion right now. I, uh, I try to think of what my grandfather and my, my parents would say after being closed so long. I catch up with the fourth generation owner on Thursday, less than an hour before his family's 115 year old business opens its doors to customers for the first time in 50 days. That's when COVID-19 shut down restaurants across the Sunshine State. I wonder what they would have done. Will they be proud when we open that door and people remember us? I'm afraid people forgot about us. Will they show up today? We learned that 50 days is the longest time that the iconic Tampa restaurant has kept its doors closed at once. That's powerful considering over the last century plus, this place has seen and survived the Great Depression, Prohibition, flu pandemic, World War II, and everything else since 1905. In March 15th is when I said I believed we would open May 21st. A coincidence? I don't think so. Gonsmart explains what safety measures they've taken to keep not only Columbia's customers, but also his work family of 1,300 employees safe. Sanitizers throughout the restaurant, training to wash hands constantly, to change gloves every 20 minutes, to distance themselves even though they're working. And that's not all. He went as far as to install a new state-of-the-art dishwasher. All those moves were made for what some may call a historic moment itself. This moment, when customers returned Thursday to the restaurant, that's always found a way to thrive, no matter what it's faced. We will be the last restaurant standing, no matter how bad it is. I will never, never, never give up on my staff, on our community, on our family. The Columbia Restaurant Group also opened up Goody Goody in Hyde Park today. They opened up Eulalie yesterday. The group has more than a dozen restaurants you can check out to find out what is open, what is set to open. Visit their Facebook page. Reporting in Tampa, I'm Price McKeon, CW44 News at 10. Perseverance. Thanks, Price.